Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome to viewers to some more Stormworks. Today I'm super excited to start a new series, uh, something I've kind of wanted to do for a while for you guys and I think and hope you guys are super excited about it as I am. Uh, I've actually been really into jet engines recently and I think it's time we start building some jet planes. So let's run into the hangar and let's start building some engines for, let's say, let's build the SR-71 this time. Let's build the Blackbird. Uh, let's go you guys. All right, we're gonna run through the door. We've got a nice big hanger to work with. So let's go ahead and jump into the workbench. And I think what we're gonna start on is the engines today. And that should be, that should get us started. Okay, we are in the workbench here. I wanna measure some things out so we can figure out just how long some of this stuff is. So what I'm gonna do is let's go ahead and go to mirror mode. And we're just gonna drag something to work off of. I wanna see what our entire space here is and how long all this is. Cause we've gotta actually make this fit. Okay, so we've got that. We are looking for how long is this? This is 34.25 meters. And the length of this is 32.74 meters. So the Blackbird is 32.75 right there. Okay, so this is the length of our jet. Awesome, okay, so we actually do have some room to work with. Okay, so let's get rid of this, let's get rid of the bottom. All right, from there, we have a wing span of 16.94 meters, so almost 17 meters. Um, I am just gonna go from the center just for the sake of math and we can figure this out. Uh, so we're doing 17 meters. Okay, let's just do it like this. We'll go ahead and, what's half of that? Half of 16 is eight, eight and a half. Is that what we're doing? Eight and a half meters? Eight and a half. So that should be the wingspan of the Blackbird. That does not seem right. Maybe that is right. Maybe that is right. I think that could be right. The wings are more way back here, honestly. So let's see. The wings would be built into this area here. Is that right? Okay, how am I off? Oh, okay. I was like, how am I off by one there? That actually, now that I've boxed that off like that, that I seem to, uh, uh, words, help me. Uh, that doesn't look too bad. Um, let's, let's see if we can figure this out. The jet engines are literally half of this plane. Uh, so they're going to take up this entire space going just across here. Let's get in and let's actually start building these. Uh, I think what I'm going to start with actually though is we're going to start with a block like this. We're going to come across and I think we're actually too close to the edge here. Uh, so I'm going to build these engines in a little bit more. Uh, we probably will end up moving these just once we figure out where things are going. But we're going to get this worked out. So I think what I was going to do is I was going to grab a couple of the uh, one by fours. Let's do this. We need to make that nose cone that is on the front of the engines here. And I think this will do it just nicely. We'll do that. Let's get our pieces like this, fill those in. All right, like so. And then the engine cowl is bigger off of this. So let's see, let's just build on this for a second. I'm just trying to figure out shape and then we will go from there. Yeah, I think it's gonna have to be like that, which is fine. That's gonna give us a lot more room for our engines. I don't know if we go, do we do squared like that and then round them off or do we round off from there? And that makes it more like a triangle shape. I don't know if that's what I want to do yet. We'll stick with, we'll stick with the big, the big square shape here just in the beginning, just till we get things laid out. And I'm not liking, I'm not liking that. We might have to make this bigger. Okay, so let's uh, let's start working on this jet engine here. Let's see if we can figure this out. This is a big, long boy here. Um, how can we squeeze some power into this? All right, I guess first things first, let's go to jets. Uh, I need to put a block down like that, like that. And then, you know what we could do? We could use the large jet intakes as part of, the, you know what, I think that's what we're gonna do. I think that's what we'll do. And then we'll actually get some, uh, we'll get some power out of those and that'll give us that. I think that actually works. I think the cone needs to be a little bigger though. Uh, do we use the small one then? I don't know. Cause see that feels like it just, it just does fit. I don't know if that's gonna be big enough. All right, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start building the engine off of this one. And if we do need to make it bigger and mess with this front end, we can. I'm, I feel like I'm too focused on that. All right, so we need a combustion chamber. Where can we find that? compression uh, i'm gonna double up this compression just because we have such a long space to go through uh can't hurt right to uh double compress this air uh let's find ourselves the combustion chamber and i'm gonna put the fuel straight down with that uh from here do we have room to do what i want to do like this i don't think we do we're gonna have to go straight back with these how do i want to do this you guys how do i want to do this because the, the one option is just take this and just come straight back until we're back here and then we have thrust. 
which I don't know if that's what we want to do because these engines are massive. These things are huge. I think we could get away with, with hiding some more stuff in these to make these go faster. So let's try this. This is what we're going to do. Let's grab our duck cross. And we're going to do the style that I usually like to do here. And we might move this back. You know, I'm going to do, I'm going to do five. Okay. You know what? Let's go ahead and can I drag these? No. All right. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to do a lot of things. We're going to bring this all the way back to say there. And we want five, one, two, three, four. So we're going to get rid of those. Let's come in with our straight ducks and we'll go to there. So far, I think this is going to work and we're going to have to hide. You know what? Here's what we're going to do. I think let's hide it with some T pieces instead. I think, oh, I don't know you guys. I don't know. I shouldn't have done all that. Hang on. Let's do this. What about this? I think if we do that, we should be okay. Should I worry about fuel consumption on the, I don't think I should worry about fuel consumption on this. I don't think that should matter. All right, so I've added the turbines there. I think we're gonna end up using the fan here. Let's, uh, which is gonna change the way things are built. So let's see, we wanted our big fan, right? We want our big fan or we want our small fan. If we go big fan, we can change this cone shape. We can bring this back some, let's do this. So we'll put a, okay, we're gonna go back to the way I used to do things. So we'll do this, come down like so. We want another turbine, arrows facing backwards. Uh, let's compact this a little bit. Let's slide that into there. Do the same thing on this side. All right, there we go. All right, so we'll come back here. Let's get our big fan. There we go. Now we have our big fan for the front. Now we have a decent size for these engines, I think. Uh, I think this is the appropriate size for these guys. Let's pipe some of this RPS. We'll do that. We'll grab a couple T pieces. We'll uh, T piece there. Why does it want to turn on me? There we go. Grab our straight pipe. We'll go through there. And you know what? Let's elbow it back around just so things are nice and neat. And we'll go ahead and grab our straight enclosed because I have a feeling that this is, we're gonna need that. All right, we'll get an angle for this corner here. There we go, now our RPS is locked in. Uh, so the other thing we can do here is, let's go ahead and get ourselves a clutch. We're gonna stick a clutch in here and then a couple gearboxes. And we'll just face those towards the engine. And I am gonna go ahead and turn one of these a three to one just off the beginning here. I think we should be good. Uh, let's do a couple of things here. Let's go boop, boop, boop. Go back to pipes. And we're gonna grab the uh, T, -P T, T, pipe, T, -P the pipe, T piece corner. There we go. Man, mouth, mouthful. There we go. All right, then we're gonna go to motors. And this is just gonna help boost these engines a little bit, get some start on these. And I think that is actually pretty good. Let's start casing some of these in. Here's what I wanna do first. Let's paint this piece black. And we'll paint, actually, you know what? We're gonna get rid of that, go back to pipes. We'll get that angle and we'll stick that right there. Now let's get all of our black pieces. And all I'm doing, why I'm doing black is that when you look through here, it'll be dark. That's that's why I'm doing this now, just so I don't have to do this later. We're gonna do all of this, fill in all of that, fill in that. And I think this will look a lot nicer as we're doing this. Come on, in you go, in we go. Fill in those, fill in that, that's wrong. Fill in that and this. Oh, forgot one side. All good. Okay, so we've got that now. All right. Clearly, this this is this cone's wrong. We can we can fix this. That's not a problem. Uh, which actually, if this is the length of things, we could shorten a lot of this up. Um, what would happen if we did that? We need four more blocks. Actually, let's let's get a lot of this out of the way. I can't go back too far. I can't go back too far. Otherwise, we're gonna have problems. So let's see. One, two, three, four. Let's try that. Let's see what that looks like. And we'll go back and start with these. Now pull it, now pull it out, pull it, pull it to there. This might work. This might work. Do that to there. All right, I think that's a lot better. I need to do this to the other side, but I think that's 100% looking like we need it to. Uh, let's merge that. All right, we're just gonna copy, slide this over. Hopefully this just replaces everything that we need, just like that. Merge it. Merge it. There we go. Uh, what is this? What are you? No. All right, cool. All that extra crap is out of the way. And these are actually looking quite nice so far, I think. Uh, let's start focusing on some of this shape here. Uh, this actually kind of expands up a little bit off of this point. So if we say popped up like that off of this, this might give us the shape we're looking for. Let's try it. I think so. Um, is that gonna allow us to do this though? No, um, we're gonna end up with some uh, missing pieces in there and that's not gonna be nice. Uh, so we'd have to go one more out with this. Is that is that what I'm seeing? 
And then I'm not liking that. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I think we're gonna move it back to the area with the actual blocks. Something that we can manipulate, because that is all, because that's all blocked too. So we'll go to there, and then we'll go to there. And then with this piece, we can come down like this. Yes, okay, okay. Come on, come on down, come on down. Perfect, okay. So let's get this shape figured out. Come on, come on down, come on down, come on, come on, come on. You've got this, there you go. This is actually working out pretty good. Um, Let's get, I'm gonna go ahead and delete all these little pieces because I know that we're gonna have to get rid of them. All right, come on, come on down, come on down with it. There you go, come on down. Extra's fine, extra is fine. Okay, that's done. And that gives us that little bit of a uh, boop shape, I guess I'm looking for. Is that really the right word, the, the, a boop? Um, it's it's gonna work for us today is what it's gonna do. So let's go ahead and let's pull this out. How far back can we go with this? Come on, let me do it to there. Okay, then we can do this all the way across. Nice, there we go. We'll drag those up like so. Let's go ahead and fix the inside here. And all that can actually be hidden in the wings, which will be really nice. But it's gonna give us more power uh, to be able to actually move this thing around because this is gonna be heavy once we start adding a bunch of blocks to this. And we can always come in here and we can always fix something too. We can always change something, which is really nice. Okay, that's pretty good. We're gonna actually have a pretty decent sized wing here. It's gonna be a thick wing, which is all right. Uh, let's come underneath and let's fix all these. All right, now let's come to the back here. Let's figure out this. Uh, this has kind of a nice little thruster on the back. We'll clean up all of this. And we're gonna have to make our own thruster, I think. I think that's where we're gonna end up. Uh, let's get rid of all of this. Get this out of the way so we can actually build here. All right, so we actually are gonna need a thruster. So let's go jet. Um, I think we'll be okay just using this one here. I don't know, let's see. What's, what's it gonna look like when we do a bunch of this coming down off of this? So we might have to move two things. We might have to move this forward and we might have to move this, a lot of it forward. I think we might have to move a lot of it forward. Let's see, let's see. If we, we can do that, we can do this. We might have to just uh, disguise this with paint. That might be the way we do this. And we do it like that. Then we can come in here on the inside. Okay, so we'll, that gets blocked off. That gets blocked off, blocked off, blocked off. And then we can come in here and round this out. That look all right. That looks like it needs to be painted right here to be the, be correct, just saying. But let's fill these in and we'll finish it in here. Most of this is gonna be painted black anyway, so you won't ever see this. Although you will be looking at this end when you are flying the thing. So maybe, maybe we just hide a lot of this under here like that, just so you don't have to look at it. How does that look? Looks like we forgot a side or yeah, those, those might need to go back one. But I think, you know, let's leave it like that. Um, those look like jet engines for the, uh, for this plane though. Let's, uh, let's get this bar out of the way here. Let's get some of this front section out. Uh, we know that this, our, our wings still need to come out to here and they kind of start like right here. Uh, I don't know which pieces is going to be better for us to do this. Let's try. Okay. You know what? We, I can see that right here, the jets go forward or the wings go forward. So right about there, they sweep forward to like that. Ooh, you know what? That actually, I feel like that turned out pretty good. And then it looks like the wing continues through. So let's uh, pretend like we're continuing through here and the wing comes to there. We get rid of all that. Let's get rid of all of that. Okay, okay. We're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere. And then off of here, I think right about here, it comes out to like there. Ooh, this is actually gonna look good. I thought I was gonna struggle with this, you guys. We'll come out to like there, and then I think, I'm not sure how to make this curve. Uh, We do one, like that maybe? You know what, honestly, I think that's it. And then we come off of here. Ooh, these need to come back further. These need to come back way further. Hold up, because all of this comes out to way, like way over here. Okay, so this needs to come out a lot further, which is probably a good thing. Uh, we can get more outer control surface on it. Uh, I think like that, and then like that. And then honestly, that'll be a good spot for our control surface. It's gonna have to fit in there anyway. Um, What if I did that? And then we go control. Which one's gonna fit in there? There we go, just like that. All right, that's kind of perfect. Uh, let's see if we can get one in here now. Uh, this is gonna have to be our, this is gonna be our pitch controls in here. So what if we just went ahead and we'll go straight across like that, get rid of that. Is that my center? That is my center. Let's grab this. I'm not worried about direction right now. I just want to get these guys kind of into place. I feel like that's good, but this stuff comes out. So 
That kind of comes out like that. Actually, I want to use the two by ones, these. Yeah, those look better. Those look a lot better. And then from here, I can do these guys back to there. And I think that actually works. Um, it, it does have this little thing kind of in the back. What if I did like that? Let's go off of this one. How much is that going to change things? Probably a lot. If we go from there to there, and then we come in with one of these like that. Does that fit in there? Oh, that does fit in there. Okay, so perfect. The shape is happening. Look at that. We are starting to blackbirds, you guys. All right, so this comes all the way forward. I didn't even want to come this far. I just wanted to get the engines done today, but we're actually getting some shape done, which is really nice. Uh, so this comes forward like to about there, maybe there. It comes in a little bit, probably a little bit more than that, to be honest, probably like that. And then it does some weird little stuff like that. And then it comes over to about here. And that's when we start to get our nose cone shape to there. Oh, is this going to work? Oh, this is so close. This is so close. This is so close. Okay, you know what? We could probably, probably do it with these guys too. This is so close. I wonder if so we're super long. I wonder if we could put this into the, like the ship segment and actually uh, make this fit. So what do I do? I'm just going to back this up a little bit just so we can get this nose cone done. Um, it's not going to make too much of a difference here. Come on, let's grab it. We'll get all of this and all of that. And we'll just cut it. And I think I need to move it back by two. I'm gonna do it by four just to be safe. Just to be safe. Okay, so we'll get that. We'll get rid of all that. There we go. All right, that gives us that shape in the front and gives us room to slap like an antenna on the front or something, right? See, radio looks like that. Will that go in there? Nope, it's still not, still too long. All right, whatever. We'll fix all that. But yeah, we're actually getting a Blackbird built, guys. I didn't expect to actually get any shape to this at all today either. So that's actually kind of really cool. Uh, we can do that and that. Does that not look like a, uh, a Blackbird? I feel like it does to me. Um, let's just want to double check some stuff here. Look at it this way. We're pretty good here. You know, we can go ahead and fill in some of the, uh, the wing spots here on these sides. There we go, like that. All of this is going to have to, we're going to have to bring this up some. And we got to figure out our tail here too this is uh something like this right Ooh, and it starts like way up here these things are big these things they come to like there then they're like super flat across the top and then let's see we have a piece like that a piece like that actually i think that's too much i think it's more this guy and then from there kind of like that angle but that doesn't reach which means now we got to do it on this angle to there which is that going to look right or is that too low looking? I don't know. They are very low wing. Actually, you know what? What am I thinking? Hello. Now we've got the room. We'll just go up one more with this. Actually, we could probably do like this if we need to. Okay, so we got to go up one more with this. Like there. You know what? We can do the same thing on both ends. We'll do that. There we go. And that's going to house our vertical control surfaces. So that'll be our yaw. I think that looks pretty good. I'm actually going to stop here today, guys. Um, we are actually really far. Let me spawn this in. Yeah, this is going to be sick. Uh, so our, our, our pilot's going to sit right here. Um, dude, this thing is massive. Absolutely massive in comparison. But I'm actually happy with this. I, I think this looks pretty good. I think we're actually uh, on, on track to, uh, to building something good here. Uh, so if you guys want me to continue this series, make sure you throw a like on this video, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And yeah, please give me your ideas for this. If you know anything about the, uh, the Blackbird, the SR-71, please let me know. I'd love to hear your uh, thoughts and uh, information down in the comments. But yeah, guys, thanks so much, and we will see you in the next one.